Hi, welcome back to another episode of Let's Chat About That. I am Maureen and I am so glad to see you again. <laughs> Today we have a special um, episode. I have invited, per your request, Abijah Perry back, the artist, and she's going to be singing some of her favorite songs for us. It's going, I'm, I'm really excited about that. But before we do that, I just want to chat a little bit. Is that all right? All good with me. Very good. So what have you been up to? What, you, what What's new? I have been writing, writing and singing and thinking and sleeping and all the things <laughs> that you could possibly imagine doing on a regular day-to-day -day basis, petting cats, pooping, yeah, scooping. Oh, okay, 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 enough. Litter, enough. scooping cat <laughs> okay, too litter. Much. Do you um, adulting things? Will you be um, performing anywhere soon? You know, I might. I will be performing down in Mount Clemens. Oh, excellent, excellent. You'll hear me sing songs. <laughs> That's what you sing. Well, I'm glad to hear that. So, you'll be singing four songs for us today? Yes, I will. Four song. Um, so you know what? It, it's one that you, that I hear you sing at home that I I just absolutely absolutely love, and it's called um, "What Is Life." Can you tell me the inspiration behind that song? You know, just to really sum it up, I hated my job. <laughs> yeah, was I, it your first job? No, it wasn't my first job. It was just a constant getting the same type of job over and over again and then the realization hits me in my head that I don't like what I do. <laughs> yeah, and you know what's interesting, when I let other people hear that song, a, a lot of people can relate to that, you know. It's that thought of not really getting where you want to be in that moment and yeah. then you um, reflect on where you are yeah. at the time and it's just like, after I wrote that song, I handed in my resignation and I left. I, yeah, it does have that impact on you. I was yeah. listening to it one day and I was like, okay, should I, should I not, should I, should I not? I do it every, every <laughs> single time I listen to that song, I was out of my other job, every single time. Oh gosh. Okay, and another song that you sing is Love Overnight. Was that um, inspired by me and your father? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Well, yes and no. As okay. you know me since I grew up with you, my mother. Since um, birth. Yeah. Since birth. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. <laughs> I have always loved romance. You have. I love love. And I don't usually say that often because I think sometimes it's weird. But who cares? Because I love love. And... I write a lot of songs about it because it's something that I one day want to experience, not saying that I haven't experienced before, but on such a level where you don't want to let that person go. And you mean romantic love. Romantically. Yeah. Like lovey, 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 lovey. Well, that's something to be taken seriously. And yeah. um, it, it's precious when you do have that person, especially that lifelong partner. So, yeah. yeah. And, and just all the experiences, whether it's up and down, round and about. Well, I am glad me and your father could um, have something to do with that. I am yeah. so happy. <laughs> so um, I'm, I'm going to let you go because I know people want to um, get to right. your songs and right, hear right, you right. sing and everything. But I did hear that you have a, a, another song that you're not singing tonight, but it's in the works. And can you kind of give us a sampling of that? The the uh, the anger the aggression yeah how did that what is that like a conversation no, what is no, that no so like so you have girlfriends right yeah your friends that you talk to all mm -hmm. the time that your go to friends yeah and then something happens so it's a setting you love someone you thought you guys got through the tough stuff right then someone not naming who does something a little dim witted hashtag stupid uh -huh. but we all know this. And then I thought about it, and I'm like, wow, that just makes me really upset, like extremely upset. And then, so it's basically like, thought I'd seen it all, no more pent up walls. And if I was like, oh my gosh, what happened? Saw my baby walking out of movie. Oh. He <laughs> wasn't alone, looking at him on my own. <laughs> So you were mad. 
<laughs> yes, every okay. single time when okay. I sung that song, it was just like. Even though you haven't experienced that, you. you I haven't that. experienced it. Okay. And then okay. When okay. I did sing that um, in public, people did ask me like, "Are you okay?" I'm like, "Yes, I'm fine." Are you ready to sing your songs? Yes. I think the people are ready for it. So we are about to experience um, Abijah Perry. She's going to perform her some of her favorite songs for us. And I will see you later. We'll be right back. <laughs> so this song that I'm going to play, it's called Lover's Lullaby. When I was writing this, it, it literally all it started out was with the lyrics. Because when I was growing up, from a very young age, I used to watch all the old movies and with the lovers and the romances and it always interested me because it wasn't just one person leaving and crying it was two people they had emotions because at the end of the day there was still love there and it was cherished and it wasn't just brushed off like another day so I released this song on Memorial Day saying goodbye to the families that were lost that had to say goodbye to their loved ones because they cared and I thought that it was fitting for this and it all just fell into place because I wrote it three days before it was actually Memorial Day and I thought it was like, wow, this is perfect timing because yeah, it's love and it's enough. Okay. Save a little tear for me. Save a little tear for me. Standing outside, watching as you wave goodbye. I won't be the only one crying. Dance with me before. With me before you leave Everything is controlled by your touch Let, let me remember How you loved me So that's one of my favorite songs that I have written and I thought it was really special, which is why I wanted to share it with everyone today. And moving on, the next song that I chose to play was a song written when I was very young. Not like I'm not young now, but younger than I am or was before because it was in high school. And it was about a boy. Like, it's not about a boy. It's about a boy that I had a crush on that was one-sided, of course. But as a high schooler, very emotional. And not, 
I can't I couldn't forget it but he probably did but it's okay I grow I grew and I mean different but it's a comforting song because it's one of the songs that I finished in one of the songs that I remember writing my very first song on the guitar and I play it any chance I get and this is it just for you guys it's called so blue and I hope you enjoy it
yeah, like I said, emotional teenager, feelings. <laughs> so any chance I get, I play that song and I guarantee you other people feel that way where one-sided crushes exist, which they do, and so forth and so on, and then the next. Rest of my life Oh, this isn't what I want to do for The rest of my life Writing songs every single day Majority of the world doesn't know they're existing Or I'm existing I already know I'm ready to shine Oh, I already know I'm ready to shine Someone told me I would fall in love Overnight And I said that they were crazy But then Didn't know they'd be right so I'm sitting here at the table Staring in your eyes I fell in love with you Overnight Words and ten thousand 
always stopping me in my tracks And I think of all those peaceful memories Baby, the way you always had my back And I knew you was something I fell in love with you overnight. Um, we are back from seeing Abijah Perry, and that was just wonderful. Thank you so much for being here with Thank us. Thank you for having me. I am so excited. Um, just real quick, how can people hear more of your stuff? You can go on Spotify with my name, Abijah Perry, A-B-I-J-A-H-P-E-R-R-Y. You can't miss it because it's my big face in the picture. So <laughs> anything else? Um, Instagram, okay. same thing, Abijah Perry. A B I J A H P E R R Y. You can't miss it because it's my big face in the picture. <laughs> okay. Are you on Facebook? Yes. Same thing. A B I. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I think we get it. Thank you so much for being here with us today. I am just so excited and I'm going to I'm just challenge all of you to go after your dreams and make it happen. This has been Let's Chat About That. I'm Maureen and I'll see you later. Bye.
ଅସୁବିଧା